Did you know they used to cure syphilis by giving you malaria? No? Me neither. I'm not sure where this would have come up in conversation, but I feel like it should have come up in conversation somewhere? Anyway, this actually won Dr. Julius Wagner Jureg a Nobel Prize, and today the practice is called pyrotherapy, the practice of raising or sustaining body temperature using a fever, hot baths, or electric blankets to kill off a disease. This practice was widely used in the 20th century, but in the case of syphilis, the idea was to infect a late-stage syphilis patient, then an uncurable disease, with malaria. The malaria itself could be treated with quinine, which has a whole nother fascinating backstory, by the way, but it maintained the high body temperature needed to kill syphilis. As malaria can kill you and multiple rounds of treatment were usually needed, this method was dangerous and around 60% of patients would relapse within two years. Still, for the era, that's, that's pretty good. Around that time, we were barely out of, have you tried bleeding them? So I think I would probably take those odds. <laughs> 